know, let me turn to you. I mean, you worked on a different kind of uh, decisions than those that Walter has been talking about. So what have you learned about the likely influence on public policy? Well, um, we have learned quite a bit, actually. But uh, uh, one of the things that we have learned is that behavior is very strongly influenced by things that should not matter. It is influenced by, for example, the way that choices are described. So um, for most people, in one of the standard examples, uh, you describe a cut of meat as 20% uh, fat or as 80% fat free, and people are willing to pay more for the same meat if it is described as 80% fat free than at 20% fat. It's, it creates a different emotional reaction. People respond to it differently. Now, the same kind of mechanism applies when people make very important decisions. So, for example, if people are choosing whether or not to donate organs, uh, their organs uh, uh, after an accident, if they die in an accident, it really depends what you define as the default option. So you can define that unless you check this box, then you will be donating your organs. And then there is that box that they can check. It's really a very, very small effort in many cases to check that box. Or alternatively, unless you choose that box, you will not donate your organs. And then you, you have to choose a box if you positively want to donate. It turns out that in Europe, for example, uh, there are about half of the countries have one default and half of the countries have another. So Germany and Austria, which are culturally quite different, have different defaults. And I, as I recall, uh, you know, it's something like 15% donations in one country and about 90% in the other. Now that shouldn't matter. It's an important decision. Mm -hmm. And the, the manipulation is, is trivial and yet it matters. So we have learned that very small details make, very make a very large difference to important decisions that people make. That has large policy implications. Turns out that how you formulate the question has a very big influence. Turns out in the UK they're applying this to uh, influencing uh, whether people will obey rules. So uh, it it is much more effective when you want people not to litter to tell them people do not litter than to tell them don't litter. Mm -mm. So by reminding people that a norm is, is normal, is normative, other people do this, you affect their behavior tremendously. So this is one of the major uh, items that we have learned, this importance of things that shouldn't matter to decisions that do matter. Mm -hmm.